We have to preach the true gospel in the hearts of people who can save and come to true saving faith in Jesus. This is the only change that we can make in the world is to preach the gospel, not to team up with people that are deceived and deceived that in the world to think in their faith when they're not. We need to preach the gospel, not just one of them. There's no unity with those people in darkness. Catholics are not Christians. They need to be born again, not join some religious organizations. No, you team up with parties and idolaters. No, you team up with parties and idolaters. Listen, do you think this is the place and the way to do it? Well, you know what? No, we do need to expose it. We need to expose it. We need to expose it. We need to expose it. Yeah. Do you think this is the place and the way to do it? Well, this is the place where they're teaming up. So if the Muslims see Catholics and Christians teaming up together and think that it's okay to pray the dead people and Mary, they think it's okay to join the Catholic Church. So they're not helping no one, are they? Yeah, but there are no there are no crucifixes, there are only crosses. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. God prays to dead people, he worships the Eucharist, he 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 practices all the things of the Catholic Church. There's no fellowship with light and darkness. If you care about your fellow man, you've got to tell them the truth in love. Yeah, I agree, I agree. This is about Jesus, it can't be about the world, this can't be about Islam, this has got to be about Jesus Christ. Do you think doing this in front of the Muslims is the Yes, I do, I do, because the Muslims need to know that Catholics are not Christian, that the only way of salvation is through faith in Jesus Christ. Well, that's what we're preaching, sister. Yeah, okay, well then teaming up with Catholics is not is not benefiting Catholics and it's not benefiting Muslims. And that's the reason why people are upset. Because we know the gospel, we know the truth. Jesus said Who's your friend over there? That Jesus guy. said, I came not to bring peace, but I came to bring a sword. It's the truth that divides us. This false unity they got going on down here, it's evil. We got to tell our Catholic people that you, we got to tell Catholics the same as we tell Muslims. You're on your way to hell, and we love you so much, so we don't want to see you end up there. And if we don't do it in front of Muslims, and Muslims that see people, uh, they they think, oh, you know, okay, let's say they come to the agreement that Jesus is God, and then they join the Catholic Church, they're still lost. They're still lost. So what good is it doing? It's not helping no one. We need to preach the gospel of Jesus Christ yeah. down here. We're not helping people by but doing it. Know, sister, that even in the Old Testament, that when God called his people to rise up, among them were a lot of idolaters. It doesn't matter at the same I time. Agree, I agree. Jesus did repentance. not. Jesus did not. He did not. He did not join hands with those that were false. He exposed it. He called the Pharisees brood of vipers. Well, he exposed that which was yeah. false. The Bible says contend for the faith that was given to us yeah, have nothing to do with the works of darkness but expose them you know Catholics say they believe in Jesus but they worship a piece of bread as their God they pray to Mary yeah, dead people they do a lot of things that is wrong Satan operates through all false religion not just Islam but Catholicism and other religions as well and we need to preach the whole gospel if we want to help anybody then we have to tell people the gospel of Jesus Christ and help Catholics and Muslims and any any other person that is deceived by false religion, including Orthodox, Jehovah Witness, Mormons, it's not about, we're not, you know, God is no respecter of persons and neither are we. He's going to condemn the Catholic the same as he condemns the Muslim. And if we love either of those people, we've got to expose the truth. And we can't team up with that which is false. Even if the best intention is there, we all have the same agreement as we do about Islam. It doesn't make any difference. You are deceived if you do not believe in the real Jesus and the real gospel. And so therefore, as much as I love you and I want peace with you, I can't have that because you're not a born again Christian. They think, Catholics down here think that born again means cult. I've had them tell me that you're in a cult because I say you have to be born again. Jesus said it in John 3. They think that it means water baptism. But if you read one to, uh, uh, Titus 3, 4, we're told you're saved not because of the righteous things that you do, but because of the uh, uh, grace and mercy of Jesus Christ, basically. And if you read uh, Matthew chapter 3, verse 15, Jesus calls baptism a righteous work. <laughs> and you will read in Acts, not one person was saved through water baptism. It's regeneration. It's about turning, changing the heart. And only God can do that. And it comes through faith in Jesus Christ because man is born dead in sin and they need to be made alive. That's what it means to be born again. You know, you know, it's not a 
Nicole, you, it's a supernatural you've rebirth. Got to get the way you come at someone is really important. If you come with aggression and attacking them, you will cause them to stiffen up and they will not listen to you. Well, I, I'm not attacking you. I'm just, I, I think you, you should share this message, but the way you do it, I'm just encouraging you. Yeah, you know what? It's fine, obviously. Yeah, this is friend, about the truth. Your friend was a little bit... No, no, but you know what? You know what I'm she, saying? They're used the guy, to it they, down they, here. The guy up they there was them. a little bit sort of... Yeah, right but now. you know what? Sometimes so passion needs... and adrenaline can no, take a hold of you. No, we live by the spirit. Yeah, adrenaline. I know, but sometimes yeah, you can... the spirit is gentle. No, but yeah. sometimes... The spirit but... is easy. No, Jesus no, never wore. Yeah, yeah, but so, no, Jesus, no, you know, Jesus did war when he wanted to war. Jesus war. Jesus war. When he wanted to war, Jesus war. You know, he, he, Jesus called people British. Jesus, he tore the Pharisees apart. In Matthew 23, he just went into them. This is supposed well, to be about, about Jesus, Jesus yeah. So yeah. Why are we fighting? Because Catholics and Christians are not, so they're not, what? they're not, not no, we're not forgetting it. We're not forgetting That's it. We want problem. Catholics to be safe. Yeah, why is it? Because we want Catholics want, to be safe. Love them. No, we love, love them, them enough to tell the truth. No, we love them enough to tell them the truth. love them. So you rather you know watch what? a Catholic burn in hell, but not a Muslim? No, 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 watch this. We so a, a Catholic could go to hell. This if a Catholic nation, died in that sin tonight, they go to hell. No, no, we don't your, focus on the world. We focus on the things above. No. What does it profit a man to this gain the whole like world and lose his soul? Jesus said, focus on the things above. The only help we could ever give anyone, this world is going to burn up. Your focus is on the wrong things. We need to Stop focus on eternal divided. life. Be the word of God divides Be us. Strategic. There's no unity with light and darkness. You Be do not strategic. love your Catholic Just brothers and sisters. You don't love your Catholic brothers and sisters. You don't love your Catholic brothers and sisters. They don't believe in the there real Jesus. You know. They don't are believe in Jesus? the real gospel. Because I know what the Bible teaches. And, and if you preach oh, any no. other gospel, that then you are, are, you are no deceived. You are to be a cat. No one has it all. If you preach there are Catholics who love Jesus, there are Catholics who worship Jesus, there are Catholics who follow Jesus, they will not go to your church, but they believe in Christ. If you that believe is what is anything else saved you, then you're not going to be saved. Huh? Yeah, but no, but you know what? It's, it's, it's the economical movement is evil. It's evil. It's evil. The economical thing is really wicked. There's no unity with light and darkness. The word of God divides us. You lot love your Muslims, but you want to preach the truth to Muslims because it's an ego thing going on. But if it was about Jesus Christ and the truth of the gospel and helping people to be saved, you wouldn't care whether it was a Catholic, a Mormon, or a Muslim. You would preach the truth on Jesus Christ, but you're not doing that. You're pretending to have unity with those that are in darkness for the sake of peace. When Jesus said there is no peace on this earth, he came not to bring peace but a sword. It's the word of God that divides. And while you focus on the things of this world, you're taking your focus off eternal life. Well, you know, like, like there is sometimes so love is, is <laughs> tough love, is you tell the truth. Oh, but you do kind of have to shout. There is kind of a lot of people that are here. So to be heard over the crowd, you do have to shout. And that can sometimes seem as if you're being aggressive, but you're not. You're just wanting to be heard. And so, you know, I believe that the only, you know, I believe judgment is coming. You don't seem to forget that God is in control. The only way you can help anyone is to preach the true gospel of Jesus. That's, you can't help them. And tell me how you're helping them then, by teaming up with Muslims. No, how are you helping them by teaming up with Muslims? I have Catholics. How are you helping anyone teaming up with Muslims? Well, you know, that's an opinion. That's an opinion. That's an opinion, that's an opinion. you don't like what's being said. That's because they don't like it. They want to see peace and unity. They don't like that the truth is being exposed and that the lies 
Things are being. The truth is being. I'm a Catholic, yes, I'm one of them. Can I just ask you a question now? You believe that the Bible is a sole source of authority of God's word on earth. Am I putting that right? Yeah, the Bible alone. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, he gave it to us through the Jews. Through the Jews? Yes, yeah, so and there was 46 well, we men. Most of them were Jewish and they wrote the Bible. Oh, okay. So and yeah. Then, and so, yeah. And, and let me tell you something. There was the word Catholic means universal. Well, I'm not, I'm not no, 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 you, wanna, you just asked me a question. Let me answer it. Let me answer it. I'm not interested in Catholic. I'm giving you an answer. It means universal. Yeah, okay. So let me answer you then. All right. So when you have people like Clement writing to people, Calling the church. I'm not well, hold on. Let me answer your question. Yes, I am. If you give me an opportunity to get to where I want to get All right, to, then I'll be patient. Yeah. All right. So when Clement won't say in the Catholic Church, he means universal church okay the body of christ christ church is his people they are spread out among the nations therefore it is a universal touch hold on i haven't finished in the third century in the third century hold on let me explain in the third century the high the um the elders of the church came together and they decided what but it wasn't until after constantine took over that it became the Roman Catholic Church. You still have enough money. I just did. It did not come from the Roman Catholic Church. And this is what they say. They say the God gave us. They say the Catholic Church gave us. I just told you it came from God. Right, and how did God give it to the people? He gave it to us from the Jewish people. Right, and then the, Jew the Jewish temple got demolished in 1876, yeah? The Jews got dispersed all over the world, yeah, when the Romans demolished Jerusalem. So where did the Bible come? Put, the, put it near your mouth. Okay, no, it's fine. Where did the Bible come the in a period before the destruction of the temple, the dispersion of the Jewish people? Where did the Bible in your hands come from? Brother, where did the Bible Conference. That's in your eyes or what you quote as well, well, I just explained to you, you I just explained to you explain. that the Church of Christ is not Roman Catholic. It was already established in the early Christian church before they came together in the third century, second century that's, that's the to New this Testament, side. New Testament, yes. New Testament. But we already had the Old Testament. We already had the Old Testament. The Bible's handwritten. No, it's God wrote it. God wrote it. I'm not, I'm not God wrote the Bible. Give God the glory for the Bible. God says in Psalm 138 that he puts his word above his name. In the time of Jeremiah and Isaiah, when they went into Babylon, the book was burned by the king. You're, you're still not asking me. I just answered you. Don't try to uh, go around the book. No, I'm not. I'm not. Yeah, he doesn't want the truth. I just answered him anyway. I just think it's beautiful. It's fruitless. It's fruitless. It's not. It is. There's, there's a battle going on. There's a, there's a new kind of battle going on. Okay. Now that guy doesn't want Catholic. Uh, uh, he he recognised we're a Protestant nation. Okay. But the Church of England got to be passed. Okay. He doesn't want the Vatican. He doesn't want the leaders. He doesn't want like the uh, royal family going. Who? This guy, that black guy. Okay. He wants people to be saved. Yeah, good. Yeah. Well, yes, so he cares about it. He doesn't want Catholics to end up in hell, and he don't want Muslims to end up in hell. But people that pretend that we have a unity with Catholics don't care about them. Okay. They'd rather not preach the truth to them. But I know that there's many born again Catholics in the Catholic Church. There's not born again Catholics no, in the Catholic Church. No, there's people deceived into it believing that. Out of it. If, yes. He's coming out, he's won the basket, he's coming out, he says it's all about Yeshua. Yeah, all right, fine. No, well, but no, listen, it's about, okay, is it, is it, is it, is it, but listen, listen to me. There's an embryonic people wanting to come out and just that you should not. And there's, there's traditional Christians, there's traditional Church of England, there's born again Church of England, there's traditional Catholics, there's born again Catholics need to come out. But they're all wanting Yeshua to let's get lost. It's about getting Yeshua. People love their religion more than they love Jesus. I guess it. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
No, Saturday. So I couldn't help myself. We don't have a speaker. We don't have it looks a bit Please, dodgy I here. I don't care about the I don't believe in the I don't believe in the I don't believe in the I just believe in him. Exactly. I'm exposed to life. Not team up with that with regard. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And so where does it to Catholics teaming up together? Evangelicals teaming up with Catholics not being Christian. Exactly. There's many people who are going to come to you and say, well, let's say, they only come to Yeshua if you preach the truth. But because of the Bible, the soul is fallible wall. And that's what you should do. So if you're living in churches that teach these things, then you are enough more according to Paul the Apostle. That's the problem. That's the issue. Christianity is not arbitrary. Christianity is not arbitrary because Christ's death was not arbitrary. It's not subjective. You must believe in him and be born again. Amen. Receive Christ. Amen. And if you don't do this, then you're outside of salvation. Yeah, amen. Many walked away from so Christ in John 6. No, but it needs Many to be walked said. away from him who came to his disciples. Amen. And now they walk away from the yeah, prophets he sent. So a lot of, a lot of these people are in it's, it's passionate for the truth. Yeah, it's just passion. It's passion. It's passion. I, no, I understand it because you care so much. It just comes out. It's, you know, people say it's like, oh, the Holy Spirit is general. Of course, the Holy Spirit is general. But at the same time, you know, the Holy Spirit is God. And God is, you know, the, God is everything. So, you know, of course, God is going to be passionate for his truth. He's the one that speaks his word above his name. God is going to be telling his truth. Jesus is coming back. You know, he's coming back to, he's, you know, he's coming back to rain as queen. He's coming back to, hello, you're right, God bless. Yeah, he's coming back to all the rain. Yeah. So, but this is the thing, they preach it down here. Also, that's a point. Yeah, and there's no unity that we have. Which means there'll be another one. Yeah. The book of Hebrews 10 says there's only one sacrifice for sins. Time. And the Catholics believe in purgatory. They believe that we purge of their sins when they fight. It's yeah. contradictory. It's quite simple. When you believe in him, you will be saved. The Bible says in 1 Corinthians 6 9 that homosexuals will not receive the kingdom of God. That's where I am. Hallelujah. Yes, yeah. Hallelujah. So Hallelujah. open the Bible and that's where you're going to see where I am. There's no other doctrine. Amen. 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 I've just explained why I was. Thank you. I'm sorry. Okay. Yes. The Catholics are not idolatry. The Bible says there's only one mediator between man and God. It's the man. Christ Jesus. The Bible says you are you are only saved by the grace of the work done by Christ on the exactly. cross. Exactly. That is the only thing. And then the Catholic Church teaches you, you can receive grace through the sacraments. Yes. And so if wrong. you preach any other gospel, <laughs> Galatians gospel. 1 8 said you're going to curse. That's why I left the Catholic Church. And so church. joining Christians and Catholics together in the sake of a peace is false. And what does Antichrist preach? A false peace. A false peace. And a false unity. And so if you're going to preach against one kingdom of darkness, you've got to preach against all of it because the, the devil don't care if you're Catholic or Muslim. He only cares that you're going no, to hell. And so we therefore, are, if you love your Catholic friends, you need to preach the truth. Nothing what we did. Yeah. Our you best is like filthy rags to so yeah. the gospel, We are only saved. God does grace not believe in Jesus it. That's the issue. Yeah. And he keeps running from us. He's called me a demon. But yeah. what would a demon do? He would preach another Christ. Yeah. The demon would preach another Christ contrary to the gospel. He, I'm not preaching that. He preach no, but he believes on churches or two churches. The ones that preach to yes. the Awesome. Is this live feed or something? Um, it's not live. Is it live? <laughs> Right, it's, uh, I'm too much. It's oh, no, it's video, it's a video. What's your YouTube, sir? Apologetic London. Apologetic London. Yeah. So uh, some people are saying that, you know, like this guy, I don't know if you spoke to him, but he's saying that he doesn't agree with God, but we should stand united. No, 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 no. There's no unity with yeah. life, we're not no. No. We're not unity. We're not unity. We are not united we are not united we may all agree with Islam, but we don't agree on the gospel, and there's no helping anyone without the not believe in the gospel. The whole foundation of our faith the is the real the Jesus Christ. You believe in them, but the cardinal sin, pride, pride. Yeah, I believe the there's, I believe there's sins. Yes, yeah, wrath, sloth. 
Yes. Um, but Christ has cleansed us of all sins. Our whole society is built around that. And yes, died because as it's, it's fallen. Totally it's fallen to yes. the hands of Satan. To we need to go agree. back to the gospel. Yes. It's not about just believing in an arbitrary Jesus yeah, Christ. We have to believe in the gospel of Jesus Christ. Christ. Right against the anti-Christian culture. Yes, yes. Yeah. satanic. Yes, of course. Not the anti-Christ, but the anti-Christian. Yeah. But it's not that's enough. It's not and enough. That's why because they, Roman they Catholics can't Christian, preach another gospel. Then the totalitarianism can come in. Well, this is the thing. They act like they're trying to do something good. To totalitarianism. Yeah, but they act... They're so adamant to destroy Christianity. But they act like they're trying to do something good. By fighting each other. No, they we're not. There's no unity with that which is dark. They act like they're trying to do something good, but the way they behave is that they care about Muslim salvation, but they don't care about Catholics. You can't preach against one religion that is false while ignoring the other one just because you share a common um, ground. Anywhere where Christ is, there's a privilege. There's a no, no, no. Yeah, anywhere in the world, no. whatever, whatever denomination where Christ is, people are, it's relatively good, isn't it? No, 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 because they're believing in a false Jesus. Paul warned us, many will come and preach a false Jesus. Tell, tell me where that's happening. Where people Catholic are following Christ, is if it's Jesus. Brazil, if it's Brazil, False Jesus, Catholic Church. False Jesus, Church of England. False Jesus, Roman Church. False Jesus, Jehovah Witnesses. 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 False Jesus, Jehovah Witnesses.
No, no, I'm just friends with them. Don't show them that you are angry. That's what they like. Eh? Don't show them that you are angry. But you will love them. Yeah, the passion is it. different. Oh, I took a pause. You took Have you got the pally thing on? Pardon? You got the Palestinian regalia on? What? Your scarf. scarf. I'm just gonna go some cold. <laughs> 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 it's not the Palestinian flag, it's just the scarf because she's cold. <laughs> Although this is supposed to be the British summer. I actually I feel like I, actually, I, feel like I told me to I get actually, the scarf and put it in there because it's I don't, really cold. I don't, I, I, don't yeah. like, I don't like this turning. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like it. No, but you know what? If we set our minds on the big rhubarb, if we preach the gospel to Catholics and Muslims, we can make some difference in the world. But if we that. just if we if we're teaming up with Catholics to fight yeah, Islam, yeah, yeah. then we're not doing yeah. no good. We're just hurting. God bless you, Ireland. What's What's your Show the fruit. You know when Jesus said, you can, you can overcome them and show them the fruit that Jesus yeah, yeah. does you, you know? So, yeah. Because if you're angry, that's what they like. Oh, yes, how are you? Where were you in Africa? 